hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel breaking vlogs uh, you know government of india has recently uploaded the notification regarding the jammu and kashmir domicile and recruitment act let us study this act point by point so that we can understand it comprehensively now there will be no state carrier in in uh, in place of this there will be union territory carrier and the government of jammu and kashmir uh, will now be termed as governor raj or elected government the act applies to all posts including gazetted non gazetted class 4th posts now who is the domicile of jnk anyone living in jnk from last last 15 years that is from the date of 5th august 2004 to 5th august 2019 that will be termed as the domicile of jnk and any student studying in jammu kashmir from last 7 years and also appeared in class 10th or 12th examination in any institute in the union territory of jammu and kashmir and all migrants in jammu and kashmir and the migrant term will be defined by the relief and rehabilitation commissioner soon the children of the following government officials will also be termed as the domiciles of jnk the officials are central government officials public sector banks ias ips irs ifs etc officials of statutory bodies and officials of central and research institutes all children living outside jk for any purpose but their parents fulfill abo conditions will also be the determined as the and they will be deemed as the domicile citizens of the jnk now who will issue the domicile certificate it will be the responsibility or it will be the discretion of the tahsildar of the respect to tahsil and the disputes or disputes arising out of the domicile certificate can be resolved resolved by the deputy commissioner of the respective district most importantly all domiciles above are eligible for level 4 posts the domicile rights and the domicile citizens can apply for class 4th up to the level 4th posts the level 4th posts can be seen from this diagram up to the serial 8 serial number 8 the posts comes under the level 4 up to the level 4 sl1 sl2 sl3 and level 1 to level 4 these posts can be contested or participated by the domicile citizens and the posts above level 4 that is from serial 9 to serial 30 containing level 5 level 6 level 6a up to level 17 these posts can be contested or participated by the candidates from the state and also by the other residents of the government of india states because there is no recruitment of any domicile for posts higher than level 4 means everyone in india in the territory of india can be eligible for the higher than level 4 unless decided by the legislature for special recruitment these are the important points to understand the recently uploaded notification of the central government i hope this short video has helped you to understand it better thank you